Hello YouTube. Good afternoon. Um, well, it looks like it might rain here. We'll have to see. Hopefully I have time to get this video in. But we're out here with the F-150. And I'm going to tell you 10 things I hate about it. So, 10 things I hate about this truck. If I can find 10. Um, there ain't a whole lot I hate about it. So, we'll get started. Okay, guys. 10 things I hate about this truck. Um, well, for one, I really don't care for the wheels. <clears throat> I think they could have done a lot better job with the styling of the wheels. That's something uh, I don't care for. And uh, I apologize for the wind noise. <clears throat> of course, another thing is, of course, I've done a video on that, um, is the seal they put around that light. No rubber seal, which caused this issue here that I would like to get fixed. Another thing I don't care for much on this truck is this area here, right up in here. That area there catches all kinds of salt and dirt and rust, and it don't take very long to gather in there. <coughs> Another thing I don't care for these reflectors I really think that should be a light or they should light up not just a reflector well it's getting kind of chilly out here well we'll open her up and we'll go over what else I don't like I think that's three but we'll move on into the truck <coughs> I did clean it out. I don't know if you noticed. Of course, I'm getting it dirty again. But, sync system. <clears throat> the way it connects to your phone and all the menus you have to go through to get to it is a real pain in the butt. <clears throat> That's another thing I don't like. And the next thing I don't like is the speakers. The speakers are just plain junk. Pop, crack, I need to replace them. As soon as I get speakers and the money to replace them, they are, will be replaced. <coughs> because that just drives me nuts and you know spend all this money for a vehicle and they can't put nice speakers in it they stick with the good old paper in my opinion that's uh not very good but um <clears throat> we're gonna move on and the size of the glove box i mean you got this humongous dash I mean, look at that. Huge dash. And they can't find another place or possibly a bigger place for another possibly glove box. I mean, you got this whole area here they could use to make the glove box a little bigger. Um not for sure how many that is but oh another one that I liked about my old 2004 F-150 the handle guess what if you're the driver you're out of luck you do not have one of those and I use mine quite a bit uh, I don't like grabbing the steering wheel so now I use the door more instead of the handle that 
would be over there, which isn't there now. Okay. We're done inside. We'll move on to the back. Another thing I don't like. That Dodge does a really nice job. I had to add these extenders so I can hook trailer chains up to them. Um, it would be nice if they'd bring those out. Make it a lot easier for you to get get to them. Um, and the trailer hitch plugs. I know on the newer models they moved them up to here, I believe. But, um, you know, they would have thought this truck through a little bit more in 2011 with the uh, tow ratings it has. You know, you think they'd have stuck that in a better spot. Oh. Another thing is the exhaust. That is another thing that I do not like. I mean, look at that. We got a barrel under there. And not only that, they stick a resonator in there to make it even quieter. Which is okay if you are an old guy. You know, who don't want to hear a truck. You know, my old truck, even with the stock exhaust and the big old can underneath it, or barrel, you want to call it, um, you still heard it. And it sounded good. But I'd just like to hear a little bit better turbo noise. But that's all I can think of. I got big plans for this vehicle. And hopefully in a year or two, I can bring a brand new one with a 3.5 or possibly the Eco Diesel. Or not eco diesel, but the power stroke diesel that Ford is coming out with um, to uh, replace this, but I won't be selling this truck. Um, I wanted one of these for a long time when they first come out. I really liked it. I do like the styling of it. Just wish it had a little less chrome. I'm not a big fan of the chrome. But uh, I got some big plans. I'm thinking about getting uh, some uh, graphics for it. Some vinyls. Just kind of set off the uh, light gold color. And I'd like to get some up here. You know, to just kind of get like a matte black. And I might do some plastic dip to the uh, emblems. Just to kind of, uh, you know, change it up. I'm not sure what would be the best color, but when I do this on these emblems, I don't know what would go best with these... Uh, colors so if you got a comment on that you know just leave it in the comment section and let me know what color you'd like to see or what you would think best to put on this truck on the emblems for the plastic dip and we'll make a video on it so that'll be it for my video today please hit the like and subscribe button and um, that'll be it for today. Whoops, sorry. It's a little chilly out here. But um, everyone have a great and wonderful day. And I'll catch you later.